the moment when you're standing there and you're celebrating the Super Bowl championship that these teams work so hard for, the players, the coaches, and you're up there and you're holding that Benson Body trophy and you're about to give it to the uh, winning team, that's a moment that you have to pinch yourself and say, how did I ever get this blessed? Hi, I'm Roger Goodell. I'm here with The Hollywood Reporter. The last time I saw a movie I couldn't stop talking about was Coda which I thought was a terrific film. It just had one of those moments at the end of the film, which I always love, which is triumph. That it was triumph all the way. And I think those are the most inspirational and the most fun for me. It wouldn't be the last time I got good advice because I get lots of good advice. Um, and it comes from all corners and I, and I appreciate it and it's helpful. And I think people need to get good advice, but the number one advice is from my dad back um, when I just graduated from college, and it was really more of a believe in yourself, um, do the right thing. He lived his life and he had examples of that, uh, the way he lived his life and actually took chances uh, that he knew were gonna have negative conse consequences, but he believed in it and he felt that this was what he needed to do. And I've always lived by that, is that even if something has a negative consequence, if it's the right thing, do it. Last time I gave good advice? Uh, well, I don't know if it was good advice, but I got, I met with our interns uh, just last week. And um, as a group, they were young, ambitious, um, very curious about the business. And one of the issues that I raised with them is, you know, sometimes success can be a barrier to further success because you get complacent. Sometimes you don't take the chances that you need to take in life. And so for me, I shared that with them and I got several notes from interns who said that was really something they hadn't thought about. So I don't know if it was inspirational or good advice, but it's something they um, hopefully took away from that. Well, that would be easy because the last NFL game that had me on the edge of the seat was the Super Bowl because it's the last game uh, we had and it was a fantastic game. The game that maybe got me most inspired last season was the Buffalo Patriots game and it was uh, the week after DeMar Hamlin um, tragically collapsed on our field, but triumphantly got back up and came out of the hospital before this game five days later, six days later. Um, and the first kickoff was returned by the Buffalo Bills, 95 yards for a touchdown. That stadium exploded. Um, it was a sense of joy, celebration, and that being in that stadium was something I'll never forget that day. Biggest pinch me moment for me every year actually uh, is giving away the Super Bowl trophy. The moment when you're standing there and you're celebrating the Super Bowl championship that these teams work so hard for, the players, the coaches, everybody in the franchise, the fans are celebrating and you're up there and you're holding that Benson Body trophy and you're about to give it to the uh, winning team. That's a moment that you have to pinch yourself and say, how did I ever get this blessed? For someone who loved football from almost as early as I can remember, um, to have that privilege is, uh, is really extraordinary. I'm Roger Goodell and thank you for watching. It was a cool experience for me, so thank you. I hope you enjoyed it.